Hi everyone, uh, Alex from alexy.com again. Now, um, today I'm going to talk to you about like the the how to create your own vacuum pack um, seafood uh, film with a gravel print on top of it. So now I've got an example that um, this uh, design that has been created a while ago. Um, while I, I, I was given uh, a brief to actually uh, make this happen and the um, the end, end result and product will be a vacuum pack so we have chosen a thick micron a film that you know if once you put the shellfish inside which is an abalone it wouldn't it wouldn't actually uh, break that film so um, so you have to discuss that with your supplier in terms of the thickness of the micron and what works for what sort of a shellfish generally you um, go as thick as possible as long as it doesn't um, really affect the costing of your uh, packaging now uh, with this with this print um, it's actually a uh, five colors we have a white color that one underneath as you can see the transparent part which is the first white layer and then followed by four colors print which I uh, see the CMYK and um, and with this the the tear off is actually on top and the insert is on the bottom this is based on the specification of the manufacturer or the packer of the processing plant and so what they do is they insert the shellfish and then they will seal it with uh, a vacuum on the vacuum chamber and just go so I have gotten a sample um, that this is the end product and this is how it looks like so it's a little bit disfigured but it's just the fact how um, vacuum pack works just uh, don't worry about the numbers it's the, one of the uh, export uh, uh, stocks so um, yeah with um, with the the way this um, packaging is designed um, it's, it's just really friendly in terms of um, uh, eat, um, how what works for the manufacturer as well we generally work along with manufacturers and, and find out uh, what packing format that they uh, uh, they have set it up and so that's that's the basic principle of the guideline how it should work before um, looking into designing so now if you look at my previous video uh, I have mentioned about like um, the the ways the quick way to create uh, your own uh, labels or the packaging or design so i'll just run through it really quickly so we got like four like five five steps so the first one is um, define the color of your directions and once you've got the color of directions you kind of get the the, the a, a sign of where you should work with so what sort of colors that you can apply the feel into the product but in this case this is blue so so it is, it is made out of like blue from the oceans and it's fresh you know so this is the color, primary color that set the directions, and and then followed by um, the style, the, the style, the style of the uh, uh, the creative design that, that you know like a couple of elements uh, that pre, uh, determine the style are the the typeface, the uh, shapes, and the arrangements, and so on and so forth. Small little, little elements that uh, um, is consistent, like for example, like the style style of this design is. This is more of a, you got you got half image and half uh, icons with arrangement of typography and uh, as you can see like the blue and the black is a dominance and, and it represent quite a New Zealand sort of style and uh, yeah so so like um, once you've got that style sorted um, the, the next one is getting the um, um, it, about the what what do you call that the design so uh put, put it on to uh go go into a drawings go into drawings and so once you start once you got on actually the third one is actually the research the research is online offline so um once you got that research of online offline uh sorted you get an idea of the directions and that's where the fourth stage is actually the drawings and the dueling so once you got your um hands on to get a feel of that concept how it's going to work then you get a pretty solid uh, idea and once you got this fourth stages of uh, directions 
you are ready to go and the first one is actually execution so generally you, you probably use um, uh, illustrator and I, I would recommend that that would probably be the uh, uh, more universal that a lot of printers are pretty pretty well handled with uh, illustrator file so now the I mean the designer will generally like um, um, help you to do that but um, you know like I'm not going to go into the details and uh, there are some some um, tutorial that will teach you how to look into the basic um, form of uh, creating a packaging layout and so in this instance this is actually created um, like like flip site you know like flip site like here and here it's actually an artwork and what it does is just print through the whole whole layer and it will just flip through and seal it boom so if you um if you can see it's actually still on the top so it just print with this and this in the same layer and it just go boom and then just fold it and seal it on top so um i mean there are you you can actually work with the printer to figure out like what what sort of a uh, print methods and just uh, communicate with them clearly and so yeah guys so well, um hope you enjoy enjoy this uh, uh, to, uh short and quick uh, uh, uh tutorial now if if you like the video just click like subscribe if you like and i'll add more videos for future and uh yeah share if you like and yeah have a good day see you guys bye